everyone today i am doing a winter haul for you guys since i did buy a few things first thing i actually got is this um kind of like kimono kind of thing and it's like a bohemian inspired kimono but it's actually not your typical kimono because it's quite warm and thick kind of like a knit material so it's really nice for winter and i can definitely layer it up so i'm actually wearing it right now because i thought it would be pretty if i were in this video it's black and ivory and it has pockets as well which is nice and keep my hands warm and it's really long as well but um yeah so i got this from zara and it's just really nice and warm and versatile so that's that now i'm going to move on to the accessories and shoes first before i go in with the uh clothing also you'll notice that most of the stuff is black and white and gray well it is winter so you really can't blame me but yeah so the first thing that I got, or accessories, I got this clutch. Now, I've been seeing a lot of fringe lately on the runways, and I realized that 90s is definitely coming back with the flare jeans and the light wash denim and the fringe. So, I wanted to kind of hop on the bandwagon, but kind of do it in a subtle way. So, what I did was I purchased this clutch, which I know I can still use even when it's not in trend, because it's a neutral color, so it goes with everything, and it's a clutch. I'm always going to need a clutch and um it's a great trendy piece it's really inexpensive i actually picked this up from suzanne and this was originally um 60 bucks but i actually got it on sale for 25 dollars which i'm very proud of it's just like a big zipper clutch and it has actually two compartments it has like a little card holder and then it also has a zippered compartment so i really like that i love the color so i got that and then i got two hats which i'm not really a huge hat person but um i've always wanted one to use especially when the sun is out or like on a picnic or a beachy day or just a really chilled out day so the first hat that i got my mom actually picked this up for me it's a crochet my mom used to wear these a lot actually it was quite trendy back in the 2000s early 2000s i remember she always used to wear it and um Blair Waldorf also really likes to wear it in Gossip Girl, I noticed, and I just really like it. It's really classic, really classy, sorry, and just really elegant, Grace Kelly kind of look. And yeah, and this one's actually pretty cool because it has three different colours. It has charcoal, black ribbon, and then the light, like, the grey. And um, it was originally 35 and my mum scored it for 10 bucks from Forever New, so that was great. Yeah, because June sales, um... I pretty much got this stuff during the sales anyway, so I did pretty much save on a lot of stuff. So that was awesome. Another hat that I got for 10 bucks is from Cotton On, and it's just like those floppy big hats. It's not too big, which is perfect because I don't want to be hitting people with this, but um, it's just a perfect size and it has like a little ribbon around it. And it's black as you can see, and it's from Cotton On. And they do have um, two other colours, I have a grey and a camel, which I really wanted to get, but I stuck to black because I know I would use it much more and um yeah i'm pretty sure they still have it in color Mom, so definitely check it out i got some witness shoes now i'm not really big i'm not really a big shoe person and you rarely see me haul shoes just because i never find the perfect one that fits me perfectly i have quite a weird foot size either like a six and a half or a seven um so a lot of stores don't carry half sizes which i find so frustrating and yeah so i'm not really a big shoe person but i have been looking for shoes because i really only have a couple of pairs they're like strapped wedges with the cork and um, the wooden part right here and i really like that about it i just think it's a different twist to your typical minimalistic strap heels i feel like these are much more casual a bit more color and different textures because you have wooden and you have like this corky material i don't have anything like it i really need them because um i found that it's special cages like weddings and stuff i didn't have any shoes to wear so i needed to buy some asap so I got them. They're originally, I think, two hundred dollars, and they came down to fifty dollars. So I just couldn't, I couldn't resist. And I thought they were perfect for even like for a lunch day. I feel like with your friends and stuff, something that doesn't require a lot of walking. I don't know if you guys know, but I have this like little obsession with loungewear and like pajamas. I I always have to buy a pair of pajamas when I go out shopping, just because. I don't know, I really really like them and I, like especially if I have really nice ones or like nice printed ones or nice cute ones I get really really easily swayed to buy them and like I can't leave the store without buying them so yeah and I don't know I just have a little obsession and I think that to justify buying a lot of pyjamas and loungewear I'm just gonna say that I use them, I live with them so 
There is no way that I have not used a piece of pyjamas or loungewear in my closet. I have used every one of them because I live with them at home. I don't dress up at home. I don't know about you guys, but I don't dress up at home. I think it's really silly because um, unless there's going to be people over and stuff. But if I'm just at home watching Netflix all day, I don't see the point of dressing up. So <laughs> I'd rather be comfortable in my sweatpants and in my cute PJs and loungewear. But yeah, that's a little uh, little fun fact for you guys. I have an obsession with loungewear and pyjamas. Yeah, I actually have a lot of them. It's a, it's a bit obsessive, but I don't care because I don't wear them. Anyway, I got another pair of sweatpants. I have like 10 now in the same color, but it's okay. Um, these are from Uniqlo and they're just a bit more thin. So they're a bit more tighter as well, which makes it more warm. Just really comfy. And I think it was 20 bucks, so that's pretty good. And it has pockets as well. So I got that. From H&M I got this jumper and this is like a, um, I like a croc skin uh, texture, not texture, print, um, but it's like camouflage with the black. I really like it because it's really warm and it's just great for my lazy days. Um, but you can actually dress this up by like, I don't know, pairing like a button up shirt underneath to make it look more put together or even adding like a necklace. So yeah, or even putting a leather jacket on top of it just to make it really um, much more put together so it's great for layering up um, and it was only 20 bucks which is really good I feel like with H&M it's one of those stores that you kind of have to really dig through to find good stuff because I feel I feel that sometimes this stuff is quite overpriced for the quality that you're getting which isn't much so I def that's why I shop at like Zara and Suzanne and you know Witchery I really like those kind of stores because I feel like their quality really justifies the price sometimes um, obviously not everything that they have in store but I'm saying like most of the stuff the stuff is basic anyway and I can pair it with a lot of stuff I'm saying stuff a lot I can pair it with a lot of different clothing pieces that I already have in my wardrobe and that's that for me only justifies the price for it um, H&M sometimes can be quite overpriced but sometimes they have really good deals like this was 20 bucks and it wasn't on sale so yeah last but not least I have Suzanne at the store um, to show you guys some stuff that I got from there and I know a lot of you guys are thinking Suzanne I feel like that reminds me of my mother well you might be right because it is where a lot of mothers shop and a lot of older women I guess it's a brand in Australia if you guys are from Australia my mom has been a huge huge shopper of Suzanne like that's her favorite store like that's her kind of Zara for me so she's like that's like her go-to store so if she's looking for something or she's just to shop she always walks in there first most of the stuff is from there she just really likes it Suzanne really really has good quality for this stuff there's no doubt about that like 100% their stuff is good quality and now recently they have actually been stepping up their game and really been uh, trendy actually with their minimalistic collection and this stuff is actually really wearable for our age or like you know 20 year olds and stuff like I feel like their booklets that they give in because I'm obviously a member the models that they have are much younger now and the, the, the way they style it is definitely the same on the runway some people still have the impression of that's like my mother's store like my mom shops there, I'm not gonna shop there. But for me, I really don't care. If I like it, I'm gonna use it, I'm gonna wear it. To me, they actually have really nice trendy clothes that are good quality, good priced, and yeah, so that's why I shop there too. And I actually get most of my pajamas and larger from there as well. Like I said, their quality is top notch. So one of the things I got, I actually bought this online, um, I got a cardigan, a black cardigan, similar to this sort of, but not really like a kimono, it's just a bit more tight on the sleeve. And I got a black cardigan because surprisingly I didn't have one. I actually don't have that many cardigans, I have more like sweaters and stuff, which I don't even know why I have a lot of sweaters, I don't even really use them that much. But I really, really want to get more cardigans because they're much more versatile and much more wearable for me. And I know that I'm going to get more, more use out of it because they're long. I can style them with a lot. I can even layer it as well. So yeah, this was just a long black cardigan that has pockets. So it's really nice and it's just really nice and simple. It's like a knit material, so it's nice and warm. And it was originally... Oh, it doesn't say the price. Because I actually... Believe it or not, this sounds really miserable, but whenever I online shop on Suzanne, I kind of just wrap, say that it's a gift so they can wrap it for me. I don't know, it just makes the experience much more fun. But they did cover the price since it was supposed to be a gift to myself. I am very miserable. Anyway, and this was originally $100 and I got it for $50. Next thing that I got, I'm really excited about this, is something that has to do with loungewear. 
I got this jacket and I love it so much. It's so warm. You would never like every time I someone asks me like where something is from, I either say Suzanne and Zara, and when I say Suzanne, they go, no way. Like, is that like for like old people? That's the always like it's the same reaction that I get. You would never know. I'm saying like they really have changed their stuff. So, anyways, I got this jacket. It's kind of like a sleepwear jacket, but it has like little pop pops and it's grey and it's thick and it has pockets and it has this very little hoodie and it makes me so happy. I actually get so excited about loungewear and pyjamas. Oh, you guys are going to see so much more hauls of pyjamas, but I seriously love this. And on the inside, it's like this really, really warm, fuzzy material and it's just uh, amazing and I have really been using it all the time. Like, I literally live with this. So... I got it and it was originally I think it was 60 60 I think and I got it for 40 40 like 38 ish so yeah really happy about that next thing I got I am super excited about um it is this turtleneck sweater cape on it sweater and I've always wanted one but I haven't found the perfect one I'm very picky actually when it comes to buying clothes because I really want to make sure that I am going to get use of it it's going to suit my figure it's going to go with the clothes that I have and it's going to last me a while those are the four things that I always consider when buying something so I know this one I'm going to get a lot of use out of it it has a massive funnel kind of like a funnel turtleneck and it kind of just rolls once you put it on but I really really love this um, it's super warm and it's long I really wanted a long one because I wanted to wear jeans with it and boots I didn't want a short one because I know that would be a hackle for me to wear so yeah I got it and I some of them are actually quite overpriced this was originally 110 and I would not pay 110 for it so I waited and it was on sale for 50 no 60 dollars which I could justify that because it's really thick and just warm and I could wear it a lot so I got that I'm so excited about it okay and then the last thing that I got it's this coat that I have worn and I really really like it it's this grey um I don't know what exactly you would call this particular coat. I feel like it's a pea coat, but it's also like a suit coat or like a lab coat. I don't know, but I really like it and it's kind of oversized a bit, but I kind of like that about it. And it has like a bunch of buttons. It's double breasted, I'm pretty sure. I think it's like a double breasted, a double breasted suit pea coat, I think. That's what I would call it, but it's really thick and really warm. It has pockets and I really like it and I really wanted a, a new coat for winter so I got that. That pretty much concludes my winter haul 2015. I'm so sorry for my sick voice, um, I forgot to mention that I was sick but I'm pretty sure you guys picked up on that during the video. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed and I hope I'll see you guys in my next video inshallah. I love you guys so much, thank you always for watching, don't forget to hit the subscribe button to see more videos of mine and don't forget to follow me on Instagram and Twitter and I'll see you guys in my next video, bye!